morning. There she is, getting a sleep on. Mm. She just uh, <clears throat> still jet lag. Only a week she's been here. I'm still getting new to this. Well, it's still new to me too, so we'll see. <laughs> so I did what everybody's saying us to do. Let's bring my wife to to America. But I'm okay with it. You know, everybody's looking for something. Even the ones here. So even if she's not genuine it's fine at least until she moves on you know it'll be somewhat blissful i guess <laughs> she likes it here so yeah like i said i did what everybody said not to do and bring my wife here to America. But I'm okay with that. Like I said, um, if she she's insincere, uh, at least I'll get the, until that time, all the benefits of uh, having a wife along with the um, the home care, like taking care of the place and things like that, because you know she was raised to be a wife, um, so therefore she takes care of the house uh, <laughs> and things like that, and takes care of me um, without without any kind of fuss or complaints. Matter of fact, her being here, um, she says she prefer the things here, like it's easier to cook because of you know the utensils, the equipment that I have in my home. And to clean the house takes a less than half hour because, you know, all the equipment I have was to make my life easy. And she coming from Madagascar, where it took like almost the whole day to wash clothes, here it takes like less than an hour and all she has to do is load the washing machine. So she really likes that. And then take it out of the washing machine, throw it in the dryer and go about doing something else. Um, matter of fact, she's finding it even though it's easy, it's uh, it's like a shell shock that she has. There's so such a big house. It's so it's easy to get everything done within a couple of hours, and then she really doesn't have anything to do. So once we file the paperwork, continue to finishing the paperwork for her to get like a work permit and all that stuff, then she could start looking for work and things like that. But. First and foremost, she needs to learn English because there isn't much she can do here uh, without learning English. Um, anyhow, if you all have any questions, ask it in the comments. Uh, like and subscribe. I am going to see, we're going to see the lawyer next week to do the second part. Um, I was thinking at first that we could just do the, I could do it myself and I can, but it seems like when you have a lawyer, your stuff isn't scrutinized as much by immigration and things get through a lot faster so i'm going to continue using the lawyer even though it's going to even though it's going to cost me another eighteen hundred dollars just to hire that lawyer um plus whatever fees i have to pay on top of that for the filing fees but i think it's uh it's going to be worth it I haven't married her legally yet, um, probably next week or in the next couple of weeks, uh, sometime in September, because she's on a K-1 visa, so we have to get married within 90 days. So that's where things are right now. Again, if you have any questions, ask in the comments, like and subscribe. You'll have a good day.